The Indian Air Force is exploring the possibility of converting its newly acquired Airbus C-295 transport aircraft into tactical air-to-air -air refueling platforms by integrating a roll-on roll-off refueling kit. L&T developed futuristic infantry combat vehicle is currently undergoing upgradation according to the request for proposal requirements of the Indian Army. The first batch of Pinaka multi-barrel rocket launchers was dispatched to Armenia earlier this month. In response to the evolving nature of conflict, the Indian Army is recruiting the main experts in cyber warfare, information technology and information warfare. Art Tech Solonics Limited in collaboration with the Indian Army and IIT Mumbai have developed an adaptive alternate power module for K9 Vajra self-propelled howitzer. The Northern Army commander reviewed the first batch of 100 newly inducted ASMI guns by special forces. The Indian Navy has inducted the 6th missile cum ammunition barge, built by Seacon Engineering Projects Private Limited. After Pakistan claimed that its 350 km range smash missile is specifically aimed at Indian aircraft carrier groups, Experts said that the Indian Navy already has several countermeasures on its warships that are effective against such supersonic and highly maneuverable missiles. Brahmos Aerospace has developed a new advanced afterburner section for the dry cavalry engine, that is designed to deliver 29 kN of additional thrust when engaged. Brahmos Aerospace has developed the afterburner section entirely from the ground up, incorporating advanced materials and engineering techniques to withstand high thermal and mechanical stresses. The afterburner will be integrated into the dry cavalry engine for rigorous testing, to validate performance and reliability under operational conditions. The additional 29 kN thrust capacity ensures that the enhanced dry cavalry engine achieves its target of 80 kN, making it competitive with its international counterparts. The gas turbine research establishment has successfully completed studies on a 3D thrust vectoring nozzle system, that is designed for potential integration into both manned and unmanned fighter jets. The 3D thrust vectoring nozzle system allows for thrust manipulation in all three axes, which means that it will give the advanced stealth aircraft like AMCA the ability to change thrust direction in three dimensions providing enhanced maneuverability and agility even at low speeds and near stall conditions. With the Indian Navy's warship design bureau Mazagin Dock Shipbuilders and the DRDO working together on two separate designs for Project 76 Next Generation Conventional Diesel Electric Submarines, France has once again extended its offer to provide its cutting-edge pump jet propulsion technology for both Project 76 and Project 77 nuclear-powered attack submarines, and also streamline the integration of pump jet technology into both the submarine designs. Today's Top 3 Comments